walking through the red meat department is like going to the Ferrari dealership. You can look, but you almost can't touch at regular prices, and that sucks. I had to pop on. Man, I have to show you guys this meat haul that my wife got. She went to Hy-Vee this morning. Just, and you know, we always go to Hy-Vee and we always check the meat department because red meat is so expensive. I always tell her, whenever I go grocery shopping, I walk by the red meat section and it's like going to the Ferrari dealership because I love to look at it, but I really know that I'm not gonna buy it. But Hy-Vee, early in the morning, you get there before the other old guys and you can get excellent deals on red meat. So let's go over what we have here quick. All right. So we've got some stew beef, choice reserve beef for stew. Now what you want to pay attention to is the price. See, all the stuff is going to be at least half price. This was 11 bucks for now it's six and it's like one and a half pounds, one and a quarter pounds, nice stew beef. Um, honestly, I either make jerky nuggets out of this stuff or she just makes beef stew. So either way, it's amazing. Five bucks, one and a quarter pounds. More stew beef. What is this one? One and a half and about one and a half. You know, so really that was like three, four and a half pounds of stew meat for about 20 bucks right around there. I mean, I think that's a great deal. It's an awesome deal. About $4 a pound for some really nice red meat. And you can, you know, it's versatile. You can do with it what you want. Then she went through and she picked up steaks. I, I kind of think she bought the whole place out this morning. So we've got New York strip. Again, the price is normally six bucks, $2 and 82 cents. It's like a half pound steak. It's New York strip, six bucks a pound. I swear, Ground beef at like 85.15 is six bucks a pound these days. What do we have here? We've got choice reserve beef, eye of round steaks. These are so tender. I can't tell you how tender these are. Normally seven bucks, she got them for four. So that is a, uh, I don't know the weight, but it was $11.20 per pound initially. So it's nice quality beef. She got a couple of those. These were just marked down from seven to four, it looks like. This one is, I saved it for last. So we've got uh, Choice Reserve Beef, Boneless, what's under there? Top Sirloin. Now this is Top Sirloin. This is bacon wrapped. It was $10.69. She got it for about half price, $5.41. And that's another pound. So we'll, you know, we'll each have a half pound steak tonight. Probably, I'll probably make these. I've made these many times before. This is also super tender. And uh, when you get that bacon on the outside, it just, it's great. It's easy to make and it's awesome. So the point of this is that I just wanted to show you that, yeah, times are kind of rough right now. Things are expensive. There's no way around it. We all know it. Like I said, walking through the red meat department is like going to the Ferrari dealership. You can look, but you almost can't touch at regular prices, and that sucks. You know, I'm a big fan of red meat, steaks, burger. I feel like it has a, a, a strong place in bodybuilding. So I really hope you enjoyed, uh, I'm going to call it the meat hall. I think it's a good name for it. Again, if you can get to the grocery store early, maybe on your way to work, Whenever, whenever you can get in. You know, you don't even have to go there every day because if you can pick a few things up, you're set for the week. Try to get in there early. All you gotta do is just walk in there, beeline it right to the meat department. Just look, look for the stickers, see what they got, get there before the senior citizens because those guys will steal the meat deals. There's no question about it. So get in there early and you're good with your red meat. Try it, let me know if you find something. Hy-Vee especially, I know Cub Foods, and I know there's a lot of other stores that are not Midwest. I don't really know the East Coast, West Coast, Southern grocery stores, maybe Kroger's, something like that, I'm not sure. But you can find these deals, guys. You just gotta get in there, you just gotta take a look. It's worth your time.